Hey cuties! So today I'm going to be doing an Edmonton haul. I went to Edmonton last weekend and picked up a lot of things. I just went to the mall in Ikea. So I'm just gonna do that first and hopefully this will be like a quick and get to it haul. The first place, well not the first place that I went, but first place in this haul is Urban Behavior. My city used to have an Urban Behavior way back when in the day and then they got rid of it. So I think the only one that's close to me is in Edmonton. So I went there. Very, very close to like a Sirens. So if you seen me do those hauls before um the first thing that i got was this skirt that could also be used as a shirt which looks like this i can use this as a tube top here or i can use it as a skirt um in my very last video my 2014 favorites that shirt that i wore i sometimes wear as a skirt as well so i can sort of do the same thing with that this looks like this this was only 20 bucks so i'm really excited about that it's really stretchy next thing is this sweater cardigan type thing and i love the colors it's like this cream and it fades into this minty green right there and it does the same thing on the back i love this i didn't even try it on i just grabbed it it's really really warm love it the last thing i got there was this tang top it looks like this i have this just like the bandeau version of this i did i don't have the actual shirt so i grabbed this and it's peplum on the bottom in love with it love with the color too it actually look go good with what i'm wearing today very pretty next i went to urban outfitters that looks like this i got some random things the first thing that i got was Snoop Dogg Mad Libs, which me and my boyfriend already did a few of these in here when we were in Edmonton. These are really funny. I love Mad Libs. Thumbs it up if you do too. And then I got a bathroom guest book, which is gorgeous color. Um, this was $18, kind of expensive, but it's so unique. I love getting things that not everyone has. Gorgeous. And the inside, it's all the same papers. It's like memorable moments and then this thing just to fill out while you're on the toilet. Kind of unsanitary, but whatever. Then I got these Furbies. They were on sale for your Christmas tree, so I'll put them away for next year. They were originally $14 each, but they were on sale for $1.99 each. So I got this red one, purple, and then blue. So these all go on my Christmas tree because my Christmas trees random if you watched my vlog, miss. Um, then I got this light cube. It's just literally a light cube. It changes different colors. This will be cute in my room. So it looks like that. Holiday candles. If you guys are hearing very loud banging or loud sounds, it's extremely windy here today. So that's that. This first one here is in a fruit cake. These candles were originally 16 on sale for $1.99. So I got a really good deal at Urban Outfitters because Urban Outfitters can kind of be a little bit expensive. Oh, this smells so good. And then the other candle for $1.99 is eggnog. And it looks like that. This one smells amazing. And I don't even like eggnog. We did actually go to Value Village as well. I forgot this wasn't in the mall. This really pretty tank top. It's nice and sheer. I'm gonna wear this with leggings and put a big chunky belt around it. I think it'll look really adorable. It's like this, it's so soft. It's like brand new. And then I got this corset. Looks like that. This also seems really brand new as well. It's like a jean denim material. So pretty. And then the last thing is this pyramid, sort of like Egyptian, sparkly. It's a pen holder. You put a pen right here. But I'm just going to use it as a decoration in my living room just because I have a lot of weird decorations in there already and I love anything Egyptian. Victoria's Secret. I was just going in there for bras because I needed new bras. Um, I got this bra that looks like this and then this bra. That looks like this. Most of their beauty was 75% off. So I got three things. The first thing is this pink, it's called Pink More Pink Body Mist. And this smells like cotton candy to me. It smells so yummy. And this was like $5 with all the discounts. I got three of the $25 beauty products as well. I got my mom two of the Coconut Passion perfumes and I got Passion Struck. Looks like this. I love their perfumes at Victoria's Secret. They smell so good. Oh, this one. I don't even know what that scent is. Can you tell me? Fuji Apple and Vanilla Orchid. That's what this scent is. The last thing at Victoria's Secret was this pack of little body sprays or perfumes there's a ton of them in there this was originally 20 bucks so i got this for super cheap as well so i'm really excited i love victoria's secret this time because it can be kind of expensive just like urban outfitters that's why i always search for deals and i didn't really have to search that hard at victoria's secret i went to ikea i got a lot of house 
things and I got a storage for my makeup collection which you'll be seeing when I do my room tour I don't know when whenever I'm completing my room then I'll show you guys that there and I got a lot of also like miscellaneous kitchen items as well but I did get this candle it's called Tindra I don't know but it smells like bread and cookies night light that looks like this I have one of these in my room already it's a taller one so I got the little short and fat guy as well the very last place in my Edmonton hall is forever 21 which I went two different times the first thing that I got was this unicorn onesie this is my very first onesie I've always wanted a onesie and it's footless which I love I wanted a footless onesie and this is like a beautiful minty color there's unicorns all over it this was only $27.80 so it's so soft I can't wait for this I got this mirror I saw it at the front there when I was checking out and I needed like a handheld mirror all mine are either broken or really really small or they don't have a hand I need one so I just got one and this was only two dollars so I was like perfect this Harry Potter sweatshirt I loved it I love the print it says Gryffindor there and then Gryffindor at the bottom as well so it's just the emblem there love it and this is so soft it's just white I was really impressed with forever 21 this time usually I go in and I love forever 21 I find a few things that I really like but this time it was like everywhere I turned it was something I love you guys know I love like big designs or anything that has cute logos on it so then I got this very similar to the Gryffindor one, but it's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's right there, and then it has all of the turtles on there there with cute little pops of color. Next sweater is this Hello Kitty one here, which was selling out super quick because it's nice and simple. It just has a big logo on there. It's like her generic Hello Kitty logo, so it'll be really pretty. Cannot wait to wear this as well. This I saw at the other side of the store and ran to it. This. It says, that's tight. Loved it, and it's a Thai logo, obviously. This one was super cheap, but I loved it. Anything bright colors or fancy little logos there, I'm at it. This tank top, which my one of my really good friends here um, on YouTube, you can go check her out, Oriana. Um, she got this, she hauled this. I think it was on her Christmas haul, but I saw it, and then I saw it there, and was like, oh my god, I loved it with all the jewels and everything like that. It's the Boston Celtics. So whoop, I don't really do basketball that much, but I loved how this was bedazzled. Anything sports that's bedazzled, they always pick up, so yay! And then I saw these pajama pants slash like lounging around pants, and these are Lakers, and they have hearts all throughout them, and these are so, so comfy and fuzzy. And I was really excited because they had extra small, and they were really cheap, only $18.80 drawstring as well right here so I just flocked these they had a whole bunch of teams as well so if you're interested they, if you don't have forever 21 near you because I don't in my whole province there there is no forever 21 you can try online as well this was my favorite sweater that I picked up um, it's this Tyrannosaurus Rex that looks like that isn't that so cool these are all like um, studs in here so they're not just like sparkles that'll flake off they're actually studs that are on there and then also his tongue are little spikes if you can see that they're like little plastic spikes this is so adorable I did get this on the sale rack this was 1180 and then 50% off of that so it all it says is wannabe which I love I love the style of this I don't know it was like kind of off the shoulder and baggy but gorgeous at the same time this cardigan oh, they had so many cardigans but this one I just I haven't ever have anything like this that's why loved love loved it's so soft it's almost like a grandma knitted it love it I love the little bat wing sleeves there you can wear this with a lot of different outfits I'm almost done I got this a uh, long sleeve shirt it has little holes here and then it has cutouts on the shoulders like this it's really pretty this is a tank top or a muscle tee I guess it says pop that and it has a little lizard there um bubble pop is that what this is imitating i don't know but it has the big armholes there so in the summer i can wear a bandeau under okay there. so the very last things from forever 21 are jewelry items wait never mind i got this little lip balm here this is only a dollar and it's vanilla cupcake this is a midi ring only a dollar eighty and it looks like this it's so gorgeous this ring i thought was really unique and pretty this was $4.80, has a little bird there, and then a stone up top in love. I got two of these $1.80 bracelets. One of them is just gold. One of them is gold with a pink heart there, so I could stack these up together. This one is also for stacking, and it was $1.80 as well, and it just says love. 
right there, if you can read that. It's really tiny and dainty. Only pair of earrings that I got, the only ones that I really liked there were these just simple gold hoops with a little crosses hanging off there. I just love gold hoops. I'm always wearing, other than right now, these are silver, but I love gold hoops. The very last thing in my haul is this ring. I've had a few of these in my life. Um, I love the ones from Forever 21. This is just a really springy, um, ring it has like ladybugs and flowers and butterflies and sparkles and it's all pasteled out there and this was 580 680 sorry so that was everything in my entire haul thank you guys so much for watching i'll talk to you guys later bye guys